Chief Meteorologist Al Coggle for the latest on the forecast. Al. I don't know. We got monkeys on the run, emus. I heard a report out of Newberry, South Carolina, of Bigfoot last week, a sighting. I mean, there's a lot going on down there uh, over the last week or so. Hey, why well, take you up to Lake Norman? I can't get enough of the shot. I mean, there's, there's just a nice, the full moon has got a reflection coming off of the lake here this morning. Clear skies here, but it's not clear everywhere. We actually have excellent visibility in Charlotte, but you go just west of town. It's a totally different story. Right now, zero visibility. Shelby and Gastonia down to Rock Hill, a mile Statesville, Lincoln, Chester. So use caution early this morning. That fog is going to lift very quickly, though. As the sun comes up, it will burn this off. But it's cold out there this morning. We're 43 in Charlotte, 40 Denver, Westport, Dallas, Belmont, 41 in Clover, 45 Steel Creek, 42 over in Mallard Creek and Hickory Grove, and in the lower 40s now out towards uh, the Newberry area. And down towards Monroe, you're at 46, 40 right now in Salisbury, even some 30 showing up. Statesville, very chilly start here this morning, but hey, we're going to wind up at about 65 this afternoon. Gone is the rain that we had. There'll be a little bit of a breeze here, but again, not all that noticeable. Pretty nice weather. That low that brought us an inch of rain, exactly what we thought would happen yesterday is now gone. So here we go. You're looking ahead to the weekend. High pressure is building in, and we'll have plenty of warm weather as we head towards Sunday with temperatures getting up near 70 and then into the 70s, I believe, as we go into next week. So right now, Sunday looks to be a little bit warmer than Saturday, but both days pretty nice, though there may be a little bit of patchy fog around early in the morning on Sunday. Cool breeze here for today, 65 degrees, mostly sunny skies. We've got those high school football games tonight. Big one is going to be Lincolnton taking on a Maiden, so temperatures will be in the 50s to start, falling into the 40s. Uh, South Iredell and Huff, one of the big games as well. All the highlights later on this evening with uh, the guys. And then Saturday here, as I mentioned, we've got a good one. It'll be cold in the morning, so if you are going to do that marathon near 40, we wind up in the mid-60s in the afternoon. One thing I do want to point out, the next round of rain we're starting to see coming into play here is Wednesday showers. That's in the forecast, and keep in mind there will be a blast of cooler air that comes in behind this. So we're already looking ahead to this, and there may be some snow on the backside of this for the mountains. At this point, it doesn't look like it would be a lot, but we will see over time. We will fine-tune that forecast.